got this shit. Watch some battles today. We might watch two if we got time. Um, but we're gonna spin this thing, the wheel. Is that scaring Betty? Um, no. Go to just... yeah. What's the sound? Yeah. Um, go to Patreon.com/slash Ruin Your Day Now to put a battle on the wheel. You can put any battle on the wheel, and we will spin it and watch whatever battle you want, as long as we haven't watched it yet. That's the big caveat right there. Um, but we're going to spin it today. Let me pull up the list. Um, or else do you want to watch the non-wheel battle first? We'll start with the wheel battle. Start with the wheel? Okay. Yeah. All right. And if you guys want to suggest non-wheel battle, we kind of already picked one, but if you suggest one that we like more, that's always a possibility too. Um, what do you want to spin the wheel to? Let's bring back the songs. Fuck, I don't care about monetization anymore. What do you want to do? No, monetization. 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 <laughs> Did you Did post, I play uh, something from? Uh, yeah, let's go to your Patreon. Or you could play. Yeah, I guess. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> what? What were you? How do I? Uh, go down, click your r ride or die, and have it as Patreon rather than creator or patron. Okay. And then click Ilmac TV. Okay, you're on it. So that one is uh, scrub shit. It's all good. So you can click weekly joints, or it's the top post. Yeah, it's this one. And I think if you just press play, it should just play the most recent song, which is actually a song that almost has made the last two albums and still might come, might come out. I don't know. I might not ever put any of these out, but the song's by nobody else. Featuring Alpha. It's an amazing artist. Produced by Chase Moore. Marcos Guerrero, he chose Raptor and Bobby Rex versus Shuffle T and Marlo. Mmm, two on two? Yeah. A bruv's two on two? Hell yeah, guys. All right, salute to Marcos. We'll get into that. I think that's on premiere. For futures that never came to us In such a hurry to live That we just got slow Yeah, so this is Took the scenic route Driving down life's road Yeah, so there's eight exclusive Also, that's a that's a live trumpet Uh Plays played by the homie Jay Glaze. That's the this, this trumpet is not a sample. It's live. Jay Glaze. He produces a lot of Eddie I's shit. They got whole projects. He was in the in town with Eddie, and he laid that for that song actually. All right. <clears throat> Hell yeah! Premier battles. Let's go, bruvs. We are just for eight. I'm trying to tell him, bring me back out soon. Come on. Come on, Premiere. Hey, they got the November event. November? Yep. Man, that's hella far away. Yeah, well, it's, it's a big event. They got Twerk on the card. Twerk Shoddy, uh, Lou Castro versus... Oh, uh, fuck, I forgot. No, they don't have a battling. budget. They don't have budget anymore. <laughs> to bring me. Put me on the, the recoup event. You know what I mean? <laughs> or the crowdfunding event. Who before. would you want to battle? Out there? I mean... Shoddy? The last person left, you know what I mean? Mm. Yeah. I killed all the bros. Nah, uh, 
Shuffle would be crazy, but I feel like we got to save that for some crazy dream card possibility of the two-on-two. Two. It's one of the only two-on-two <laughs> two teams I'd consider yeah, battling. I think that's appropriate. Them. It's probably the only one I'd yeah. consider battling is them. Yeah, I think it would kind of be a, um, not a miss, but it would kind of be like, yeah, we want the two-on-two two, yeah. you know, for that. Yeah, me and Frack versus Shuffle and Marlo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Frack and Shuffle is the battle. Yeah, I'm yeah, like, yeah, that's yeah. the battle that should happen. Yeah, yeah. the 1v1? Yeah. For sure. That'd yeah. be fire. As that's got to happen. But you versus Shoddy would be crazy. I know that Shoddy would really like to do that. He respects you a lot. Um, and that would be a crazy main event over there. Um, who else would be good versus for you? I mean, you could always do... You've gone over to the UK and you've taken, like, people that not might not necessarily be on, like, a, a battle list for you to move up a rank. And it's kind of like you're kind of giving somebody a shot, you know? And I've always enjoyed those battles a lot. So. Yeah. I'm at a point. It's just if it's inspiring to me, honestly. I feel Gemini's really good, too. Yeah. He battled Soul on the URL. Yeah, yeah, Could. he's he's super good. Um, I think he's having a battle that is coming out soon. That's really he also good. had a crazy one with Shocks the Rebel that we yeah. watched on here. I think. Yeah, 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 yeah. You battled Shocks over there. <laughs> Can't believe I forgot about that. <laughs> um, yeah, I was like, no, you <laughs> did. You're, You're like, like yes, what? You did. <laughs> you filmed it. I'm like, what the hell are you talking about? All right, shout out Hot Take for the five in the chat. <laughs> Manchester for Apex, freeing the headline off. If you with us in the building, make some noise! I love Premiere so much. The, the design, too, like little like uh, bar at the top. I don't know, mm -hmm. they do like cool little designy shit that I'm, I like. Yeah. It's like different, you yeah. know? Can it Christmas sure. announcing this one? On the it's right really hand like side! Sports. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, it's sports inspired. From Manchester, so, making his yeah. debut at 2 on 2. Make sure. Yeah. Some noise for Skate! Yeah. 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 Let's go! Yeah. Oh, my oh, boy! Finally! Oh, and on the left hand side, making the debut as a team in Premier Battles. You've seen it before. Make some noise for Shuffle! Yeah. Oh, so they're t they're, they have team names. They kind of confused me. So Bobby Rex and uh, Raptor, they have a team name that I missed because they're like, make some noise for this. And I was like, wait, what the fuck? Are we watching the right battle? Yeah. <laughs> it's, like, it's like Raxter Bob Hurst. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, Marlo and Shuffle look like every filmmaker ever. <laughs> Dog. <laughs> Seriously. That's hilarious. <laughs> like, they look like everybody that walks into the Criterion collection and collects DVDs. <laughs> Yo, it's a free round battle. I'm gasping it. Shuffle decided to start in round one. Manchester Shuffle wants the Shuffle. Let's go. You ever seen I still prefer Charlo. Charlo, you ever seen that uh, that Raptor battle versus uh, uh, Red Flag? Where he's like, you're on that side of the courtroom. Uh, uh, blah blah blah. Like he like has this. Do you want to watch that one part of that battle? It's like fucking. It's like the best thing Raptors ever said. It's like so fucking good. It was Raptor versus Red Flag. Yeah, out I think there it, because Red Flag's a lawyer, and he. I'm and I'm gonna butcher it. That's why I kind of don't want to. Here, let's just watch it real fast. Okay. Nice. Is it con contextual? Sort of. Mm. They direct an A A24 film later. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Salute to A24. Yeah, they're fucking with uh, uh, Joe Joseph King. They went to, they did go to film school. Yeah, with another, that another Joseph, filmmaker. With Joseph King. Here, all right. Joe King, the son. Nice fight. Kill you. Yo, well, these boys yeah. appreciate <laughs> defending the case. In a knife with. Shout out to Noah Weston in real time. I can't see picture. for you. Holding a knife was only ever said on a stage. For me, holding a knife is a fucking regular day. Check, check the files. Even my record displays possession of blades. You are a lawyer. Everything's straight. You're on that side of the courtroom. Defending the case, I'm on this side of the courtroom. That's my second situation. I'm on that side of the courtroom. Yeah. Well, <laughs> About knife by fucking king. See, for you, holding a knife is only ever said on a stage. For me, holding a knife was a fucking regular day. 
check the files, even the record displays possession of blades. You are a lawyer, everything's straight. You're on that side of the courtroom, defending the case. I'm on this side of the courtroom. As my sentence awaits, you're on that side of the courtroom, getting paid. Come the end of the day, I'm on this side of the courtroom, watching my mother cry as he led me away. How the fuck are you? <laughs> I fucking love that. That is so fucking hard. That's crazy. That's so fucking hard. Not to be a stickler. <laughs> but to be a stickler. But if he's saying that red flags on that side of the courtroom defending a case, Rapt is also saying he's the defendant. He'd actually be well, on the, the UK. same side of Things the Things work differently. Oh, there. yeah, the powder wigs. Yeah, it's just, and everything's it's flipped. Like, it's in the town square. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hang him! <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's a public wood, hanging. Wood shoes <laughs> <Yeah>. in <and laughs> the public square. They're making toys and shit. <laughs> <laughs> we just think For of sure. Pinocchio. Yeah, they're just throwing rocks at him <laughs> yeah. and everything. Okay, I got you. But yeah, I love that by Raptor. That shit's fucking fire. But let's get into this one. <laughs> Scapegoats. So the name is Scapegoats. The slogan, you can't spell scapegoats <laughs> without putting the goats in it. Astutely observed. <laughs> it's true what you've heard. Rumor confirmed. <laughs> you can't spell a word without using the word. <laughs> From my experience, that is how it usually works. <laughs> Jackson Raptor says it all. <laughs> Dinosaurs. <laughs> very cool. <laughs> As a name, very fucking action packed. <laughs> a dinosaur. <laughs> that was like part of the rhyme. Pew, 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 pew. That's Boy. fire. Action packed. <laughs> As a name, very fucking. A dinosaur boy. <laughs> Jurassic twat. <laughs> come on, come on. All right, put down the cameras, you stupid prick. How did you get this many actors and stooges, Briggs? Oh, you gotta appreciate I, I appreciate the commitment from Manchester to the bit. You've even got back, no, you lunatic! <laughs> <laughs> oh. This isn't a prank, huh? Are we actually doing this? <laughs> oh, I fuck it then, we're back! Who's missed us? <laughs> Who's missed us? Wait. Oh, nice. Hell yeah. Is that like Sharpie on the front? <laughs> yeah, it does. It looks like it. <laughs> Amazing. Hot take with another five euros or pounds. Either way, it's probably like three hundred dollars in in hey, USD. Hey, don't come on, chill out. And we've not lost our title, fortune, and fame. I screamed at Tox one time. Knives and forks on the plane. Hundred pieces of the pie. And since you're finally walking away, I'm here to see you off tonight. Meet the minor tours of the maze that you've each been locked inside. The fire doors are escaped. Completely. Man, off. it's interesting the pronunciation. The minor tours. Oh yeah, yeah. Because that's totally how they pronounce. Minotaur. Minotaur? Mm -hmm. And we Minotaur. 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 Yeah, it's Minna, but they're yeah. Mino. Mm hmm. We bastardized the, the Queen's tongue. I know. You know what I mean? We, we are bruised. And <laughs> we've not lost the height. We've got titles, fortune, and fame. I screamed at Tox one time. Knives and forks on the plane. Hundred pieces of the pie. And since you're finally walking away, I'm here to see you off tonight. Meet the minor tours of the maze that you've each been locked inside. The fire doors are escaped. Completely ostracized. The sirens call in your face. You'll see you've lost the fight. It's time to call it a day. But at least you've got your pride. We've done a live performance for Drake. We've beaten gods of pride. Give time, exhaustion, and pain. The 
past the peaks and troughs of life. We have climbed and fought with the greats. Well, you just teetered on the side. Of course the dinosaurs were afraid. We've had a meteoric rise. That's crazy. And also the way they juggled that was crazy because they were doing an A-B rhyme where they both were doing the different part of the rhyme structure. And so it would be, it was, uh, it was Mar Marlo doing A, shuffle ending B, A, B, mm -hmm. A. And then, sh uh, then Marlo said the ending and started the next, like they traded off. Mm. So then Shuffle was doing the setup on the next one. A, B, like they flopped, switched it. So they both got the enders and they both did the, you know, that was, that was kind of crazy right also, there. Well, super well choreographed. Their chemistry their together is like 100%. Yeah, it's super fun. Well, you just teetered on the side. Of course the dinosaurs were afraid. We've had a meteoric rise. Yeah, that's insane. I want to go back just to see the transition, like how they yeah. switched it. Night, meet the mighty hundred pieces of the title. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Night performing on stage, and we've not lost the hype. We've won titles, fortune, and fame. I screamed at tops one time. Knives and forks on the plane. Hundred pieces of the pie. And since you're finally walking away, I'm here to see you off tonight. Meet the minor tours of the maze that you've each been locked inside. The fire doors are escaped. Completely ostracized. The sirens calling your face. You'll see you've lost the fight. It's time to call it a day. But at least you've got your pride. We've done a live performance for Trey. We've beaten God. That's where it's Here's the time, yeah. exhaustion, and pain. That's the peaks and troughs of life. We have climbed and fought with the greats. Well, you just teetered on the side. Of course, the dinosaurs were afraid. We've had a meteoric rise. That was insane. Insane writing. Great performance. See, scapegoat. Scapegoats for the shuffle. Just shuffle, not both. Just me. Shuffle. <laughs> That's something I can't understand. Every battle we have captivated. You're both our biggest fans. Makes me feel like I'm 10 years old at the farm with my dad because the ghosts have been eating out the palm of my hand. Mm. Shuffle tea, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> battle with Shuffle? You won't. Normally, I don't. Uh... I'm not gonna like defend and you know, but there's a comment that's like, oh, 16 lines just for that line. Like, but people who are only watching battles for the punches are the reason that terrible writing is the standard for good writing because everyone just rushes to get to a punch, doesn't give the right context, and therefore forces like. 99% of like people who are considered good writers, I'll be watching like, this doesn't make sense or it only works one way. Mm -hmm. But that's what happens. We don't take time to contextualize. But also with a two on two, it's more than just the punching. We're talking about the yeah. dynamic, yeah. like what they just did yeah, totally. with how they were yeah. interchanging and interweaving yeah. is just as impress impressive yeah. as any just punchline thrown in there. Yeah, you yeah. know what I mean? Like the sheer structure of the writing was insane, yeah. let alone how they actually performed it. And a lot of the biggest things in two on twos isn't necessarily a punch. It's like the Math Cortez, Millie Rock, like even Twerk jumping over Shug. It's all like a dynamic thing. Yeah. It's kind of more like showcasing. But also what you're saying too, and I agree with, is like, it's not all just about punches. You know, it's no. good rapping is a huge part of battle rap. Yeah. And that and was most great people, rapping. Because a lot of fans are conditioned where rapping is not part of battle rap. Yeah, yeah. It's mispronouncing words <laughs> yeah. and tying oh, disparate, yeah. unrelated concepts together yeah. or like Obscure doing athletes. all this like pointless wordplay that has mm -hmm. nothing to do with your opponent. And everyone's like, oh, I get it. Like yeah. he said something wrong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Clever. Yeah. <laughs> you know what totally. I mean? Totally. Like, yeah, even like in uh, we watched Mook and Verb back with Big K and ARP, and I don't know if you remember that battle at all, but there was this point where Verb was like, he's like, you're like this ca this uh, snake in a cage, and the executives come out every now and then and dangle a mouse in your cage, and you eat it, and they like get enjoyment out of that, and then they like retreat, and it's not like there's a big line there, but that imagery and that metaphor I thought was like insanely creative and fucking cool, and like how he presented it was so dope, and there was no punch there, mm -hmm. there was no like double meaning, you know, really. There's gotta be 
room for variance and style to be able to cut your opponent down by making points, angles, uh, actually rapping yeah. the rare thing yeah, yeah. in battle rap yeah, uh, yeah. for all, all the things. Like there's otherwise, everyone just sounds the same, mm -hmm. you know, which is. A little bit of the case, but we want to get away from that and yeah, appreciate yeah. the variance and yeah. the other aspects of this shit. Totally. And they did, did it well. Also, how they utilized their vocals. It was a it was a gradual build up, even in their tone. Mm -hmm. The na 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 na, the ba na 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 na. Like there's yeah, yeah. there's a lot of intangibles happening, you yeah. know. And they've really mastered their craft, you know, and are unique as fuck. No one's like Shuffle and Marlo. Yeah, yeah, they're super unique. The palm of my eye. Shuffle, you won't dare. Honestly, I wouldn't go there. You, you think your best shit, they won't care. We left the crowd doing that thing where they go, yeah. <laughs> like that. Like that is so good. So good. It's so well performed. The sh <laughs> like Marlo's little. <laughs> That's so amazing. <laughs> Yo. Oh my god. Shout out uh Harith or Harith with the five. Appreciate you. Thank you, man. Yo, run this part back. That's yeah, the yeah, big. I love that. And they're, they're like kind of going circular, like yeah, in, yeah. in a circle <laughs> with the performance. It's really unique. Really good. <laughs> but with Shuffle, you won't dare. Honestly, I wouldn't go there. <laughs> Shit, they won't care. We have the crowd doing that thing where they go, yeah. <laughs> so good. Oh my god, that's so funny, dude. Amazing. I've done that in so many battles. So many battles where people are kind of cheering, and I want the crowd to get more engaged, and I just go, yeah. And then, it, and then it everyone, on. yeah, never. It's so like, crazy. Yeah. It just takes one person to do that, yeah. and it like catches on. Sometimes you know you'll be the only. I need person you doing to do it. that every four bars for my you? next battle that you film. Word, word, of course. <laughs> <laughs> so you're you're retiring, Raptor, yeah? You're, he's retiring. Yeah. You you're exactly. <laughs> what fucking attempt is this? Seventy six. I've lost track of all the times this guy's pretended to quit. If you're not careful, you might run out of the hunger and passion you get to exit the ring and have to make this battle rap and malarkey a regular thing. <laughs> <laughs> you're always going malarkey. as well, then come back again at breakneck speed. Oh, Bobby's quit. Does he tell a lie? He's at Apex 3. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's updated the status now. It's official. He has gone. Right. I guess the battles are, oh, no, tell a lie. It's that <laughs> Now, we've been fairly busy recently. That's just the way the place is spinning. So you're not getting the best shuffle. It's a lazy day. We're chilling. You're getting about half of our best efforts, but we'll still take away the winning. We've gone from about a nine to five. What a way to make a living. <laughs> Depression. We're planning on writing our third round. And you're performing your second. <laughs> think, <laughs> yo, <laughs> think takeout in the 90s. We're phoning it in. Think police at a crime scene. We're phoning it in. Radio contest, i.e. We're phoning it in. We're using punchlines and rhyme schemes. We're phoning it in. <laughs> seriously, that's that's seriously. That's, 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 that's amazing. We've gone from a nine to a five. We're phoning it in. Like some detectives that have arrived at a crime. See? How, did you hear that fucking punchline? You're right for it, guys. Boys, if anyone's beating Shuffle, tonight, tonight is the night. <laughs> speaking of which, speaking of which, right, right. Theo, yeah. Angles, what will they use? Oh my god, I don't think I'll go the obvious route. Right, you can say that I'm obsessed with multi. Yes, that's got to be you. And you've got to assume, logically, route they're talking about are still battling don't crop in this room. Oh, I'm yeah! And they'll say that we've like fallen off and you know we're long in the tooth and the golden, golden days are over! Are not the views. <laughs> oh that bit's gonna be sick! They're trying to drive a wedge between it totally us. Do it properly too! Oh I hope so, Theo. Topical. New! <laughs> Topical. <laughs> New. Aggressive, aggressive. I am not gonna move. I'm just gonna stand here in this spot while I'm glued while he's all up in my face. Fucking Bobby the Brew! <laughs> I can't wait to find out who they're 
them are horrible to. I don't exactly think it's going to be compliments. New. <laughs> <laughs> think of them. Think of the choreography. True. They've got to have moves. Bobby can groove. Ratter. <laughs> Come up this way. Awesome. Oh, let the side down. Don't battle as often as you. Yeah. <laughs> Feels like something maybe Bobby would do. Possibly true. I just think that like raptors like anger, aggression, demonic, and ooh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> raptors got the comedy too. Careful, don't get too close. But not in a zoo. Listen, raptors the more strong of the two. I mean, he's got more bodies than Bobby. He's got more bodies than you. <laughs> <laughs> No, I'm just saying, uh, he's, a, he's a popular... Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, but, uh, I didn't want to review, you haven't got to be rude. I was not being rude, that's just obviously true! What are you saying, what are you saying, that I've got to improve? Adam, you know I'm not having a go! It's not exactly a confidence boost, if you wanted to make me feel like shit, mission accomplished to you. <laughs> true. Well, what can I do to soften him? You could let me do a really long scheme of like 20 lines where we have 15 syllables in every rhyme. But that's literally all that we ever... Fine, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think they'll say about us seriously? Posh, fat, ugly. <laughs> but they'll wait till round three. Posh, fat and ugly. Yeah. What do you think they'll say about me? <laughs> yeah. That's you won't really go for those easy approaches. Him and Bobby know that. Anyway, where are my manners? Yeah. Off you go, lads. Yeah. Oh, that's fucking nuts, man. It's, it's, it's like, so it's, fucking entertaining. It's like insane. It's so theatrical. Yeah. And it's just so much more happening, you know? Yeah, totally. It's a real performance. Like, yeah. The, the awkwardness yeah and it's, it's really clever man they're 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 definitely one, two of a kind yeah you know what i mean super clever yeah even if you put down like the concepts on paper you're like yeah okay so you guys end up like battling each other or, like riffing off each other but mm -hmm. the way they present it is so fucking original oh yeah the committing and the acting and the yeah. comedic timing oh, is God. just so, so perfect so, so perfect both of them yo all right scapegoat so go. we get started we just like to apologise for our behaviour in the past. <laughs> it was truly embarrassing as men. And that is not something that we are about to try and stand here and no. defend. Because that would be pretending that we hadn't actually offended all of the people we consider family and friends. <laughs> <laughs> it was pretty bad though, wasn't it, Raptor? I know, Bobby, but it's not like it was ever done with any anger or contempt, malice or intent. Yeah, I mean, but we did still do a lot of fucking damage in the end. <laughs> So I've forgotten about now though, bro. Plus, it's not like it's gonna start happening again. <laughs> yeah, you're probably right. I mean, Briggsy did book us for this battle and we are always in the gym with Adam getting hench. Bobby! <laughs> yes, Look at dude, hench. Hench. We just start saying hench. Yeah. Let's get hench, bro. <laughs> yeah, the other day at the gym, someone's like, oh, what do you do? Because he oh, had obvi yeah. Yeah, he'd obviously like, recognized me when I, me and Ava were at uh, 24. Wait, meeting no can actually fucking battle rap fitness <laughs> uh but the dude was just like hella staring at me or whatever and as we go to walk away he's like hey like what do you do and i was just like just get big <laughs> i'm just in here getting big but it should have definitely said just getting hench getting bro. hench yeah, yeah. that would have blown his mind like what <laughs> yeah yeah just fucking like, pink eye you just <laughs> vessel butt yeah. burst in his eye Getting hench, that's amazing. It's gonna start happening again. <laughs> yeah, you're probably right. I mean, Briggsy did book us. Do you know what they're referencing here? Like, did they choke or have some they awkward just, thing? Both or of them threatened just, someone at a previous. Yeah, event? they've kind of been riddled with controversy throughout their careers. They've like gotten pretty physical at times with people. Um, been late. I don't know about like great egregious things but it's just like they've kind of been a liability at times right right okay because it sound, almost sounded like they're mentioning something they did as a duo no I'm just i think not. this is the first time they teamed up correct gotcha. me if i'm wrong but yep. yeah <laughs> yeah you're probably right i mean briggsy did book us for this battle and we are always in the gym with adam getting hench bobby look around they're filling up capacities again 
You keep on rap is gathering momentum and recapturing its strength. Yeah, you're fucking right, you know. Yeah. Rap to it makes sense. This, <laughs> this is a chance to get redemption and all those who laughed at our expense. We can be like them, bro. What? You mean like being dead happy at events? <laughs> <laughs> Being dead happy at events, everybody laughing with the mm. friends. I mean, we can start travelling with the hair. <laughs> bro, this is the happiest of it. No, because we've still got to act as if we're gents. Yeah. So don't you be going getting active in the gents. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Manners and respect. If anybody says they've got a problem with us, I'll tell them it's one that we're happy to amend. No <laughs> joke, we might no longer be a band that they resent. Precisely, Bob. So you ready? Exactly like we practiced it again. Right, let's get cracking with it then. <laughs> this is a promise. To every fan that's in attendance, standing at rebellion, and every battle rapper that we ever managed to offend. To the bones who's standing at the entrance, to the staff and all its members, and anybody else who flies the flag and represents. We will never, ever, 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 ever. ever. Battle rap is in descent. <laughs> oh, let's go and fucking ruin it, battle rap. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> He's just doing the rap recall. You gotta make the end. Take that scene from Jurassic Park when the raptors are coming into the kitchen. With yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yo, somebody's in the chat said uh, Raptor is Jamie off Ted Lasso. I'm hella weak. Oh my God. <laughs> That's hella funny. Because you know what? Fuck this shit. I feel like sniffing drugs. You know what? <laughs> yes. Sniffing drugs. <laughs> yeah. That's amazing. Man. Manchester was a great time. That's how they kicked it with Bobby Rex after, you know what I mean? It was great. It was a fun night. Yeah. Good times. Fun night. You know what I'm told. You know what? <laughs> Fuck it. Me too. Did you bring us up? Did you bring us up? No, do you know what? Fuck it. I feel like sniffing drugs. Do you know what? Fuck it. Me too. Did you bring us up? Well, I was going to when I went to Jimmy's, but uh, Lisa answered and said that he isn't up. Hey, I've got a bit of dough though. Get on Ricky, bro. I'll ring him up. <laughs> Yes, Ricky, it's Bobby. I'm, I'm after a bit of stuff. <laughs> You're always six enough. Well, how much is one? Okay, <laughs> hold on. Uh, someone in the chat said Shuffle and Marlo had the Let's Save Battle Rap again line. So that like is why the significance of let's ruin battle rap again, oh, like yeah. as well Word. as uh, like never, ever, ever, ever like back and forth. Oh line. yeah, 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 yeah. It's a callback. So okay. Yeah, yeah. Because I wasn't That's sure. Good to know. Yeah, me yeah, too. Yeah. I was confused why people were cheering for that. I was like, it must be something I'm unaware of. Yeah, but yeah. Yeah. Thank you for that info. Yeah. Good shit, chat. Bobby, I'm, I'm after a bit of stuff. <laughs> I'll ring him up. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Ricky. It's Bobby, I'm, I'm after a bit of stuff. <laughs> You're six enough. Well, how much is one? 50 both. Fucking hell, bro, I ain't got that much. I'm skinned as fuck. I'm a Give a lot, give a lot. Oh, I'll put them in the back of my pocket, sorry. <laughs> Will you check it, boss? <laughs> <laughs> well, what did he say? Not a chance. <laughs> really? Honest, man. What a rap, bro. What are we gonna do? We've got a rap. All right, chill out. I've got a plan. Chill out. Have you forgotten that both of our special powers come from no. our back? <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. You've forgotten that both of our special powers come from a bag. Oh, All the fact that we have to sniff a line to get one delivered right from a bag. I know. Mate, we are not going to be the same unless we obtain some narcotics fast. <laughs> Roger that. Shuffle. Come here a sec, mate. I want a chat. 
Now, I know for certain you just overheard the little problem that me and Bobby have in booming at night in Leeds, mate. That's it. Me and you went on the lash, got proper smashed. Well, that night, I fucking lost the bag, which I heard you found at the bottom of your glass. Now, I fucking want it back. <laughs> Last time I tried them, they didn't work. What, like it's the verb? Bro, check it out. Fucking Coke and shit in, in England is probably so expensive. Compared to here. Like, getting it there, I just imagine, like, because it's, like, we're relatively closer to from where it comes from, but, like, getting it over there, I just imagine it's, like, fucking astronomical. Like, almost, like, wasn't weed expensive over there, too? Uh, has weed came out over there? No, nah, I think they're still behind. <laughs> <laughs> they're still on the wall. Uh, yeah, I mean, maybe. I would just imagine. I mean, I don't know. I can't remember. Yeah. I had fucking, you know, Eat. second half of yeah, my yeah, battle yeah. deposit come in. You know what I mean? <laughs> I'm just fucking <laughs> living life. Yeah. Fucking. Black car. Yeah, I don't even care, bro. Yeah. Tell me how much, yeah. you know? <laughs> <laughs> check it out, check it out. I just come up with an idea for the sickest verse, and I'm pretty certain that if we spit it perfect, it'll hurt. Oh shit, have you been digging dirt? Well, let's just say this little bird, he got up oh. early and has given me a tin of worms, and we're about to expose this pair of pussies like we're lifting up some mini skirts. <laughs> Somebody said 50 a gram in the UK, so it's pretty, pretty much the same. Oh, okay. Word. I mean, shit, a lot of times it's like 60 out here. At least it was back, you know, yeah, years ago. ago. Yeah, I, yeah. <laughs> back in the so, day. Yeah, last time I Googled that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, last time we checked on it. <laughs> yeah. 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 Pretty much the same. But 50 pounds or euros is like, you know, I don't know. Can't do the math. $3,000. Yeah. 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 We're exposed this pair of pussies like we're lifting up some mini skirts. Yeah. <laughs> Are you backing it? Are you backing it? Well, of course I am, but what is it first? Right, so what we're going to do is hit them with it in the third. Yeah, but <laughs> tell me what it is you've heard, bro. Well, these two aren't even fucking rappers. They're just really good at picking words. <laughs> 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 bro, these two aren't even fucking rappers. They're just really good at picking words. They're actually a pair of actors, and this is just a script that's been rehearsed. Oh. Hey, you fucking idiot. What? Well, I've already tried that, and it didn't work. <laughs> This is just reminding me of like uh, like uh, the main villain and the sidekick from like Home Alone, like <laughs> they're like side argument or something like that. You know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like yeah, even yeah. the accents too is like playing into it and like their whole like a dilemma, you yeah, know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's hella like movie-ish. You yeah, know? Marv and um, ah, shit. What's the skinny dude's name? So oh, there's yeah. another like one or two syllables. It's like Marv and Quest. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I've already tried that and it didn't work. <laughs> what the fuck you mean? When I bottled shuffle tea? He bottled shuffle tea? Are you fucking kidding? <laughs> uh, but when I bottled for that dickhead, eh? Uh, right? Harry. Harry and Mark. Fuck it! Fuck it! And he rang his mum. His mum? Why is he winging her? <laughs> well, I don't know. That doesn't matter, bro. But you have to know, as far as angles go, you have picked the worst. Well, where was Mark when all of this happened? Well, I don't know. Probably fucking with his bed. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know. I guess he'll even learn. <laughs> Anyways, listen. This will work. I've got a plan B. What these need is a dose together that all medicine, so let's hand feed them a double dose like a vaccine. Yeah, let's have a scrap and jab these. No, that is not what that means. <laughs> For example, let's talk about his book. I know it's a product of a question that every fan meets, you know, every status he puts up, another page goes in his book, along with money, tax-free shit. I had a book like his once. It was called fucking Ash Jeeves. <laughs> <laughs> I hear what you're saying, Raptor, but if you ask me, that's weak. Let's talk about his book that all the fans read. That shit sold last week. Yeah, to be fair, and it's next month when it gets done by Crafty. Exactly. <laughs> For plan C, yeah? What's that, G? An absolute guarantee oh, that no. with me we're gonna see them off. Oh. You don't believe me? What? See, I've just remembered something, it seems that we forgot. <laughs> well, let me the then and reveal the plot. Check it out, bro. We're gonna talk about them being <laughs> <in the> <laughs> <laughs> right? 
Check it out, bro. He said, reveal the plot. So what we're going to do is talk about him being posh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, I'm leaving, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you, Peter Tosh? Look at him wheeling and skeeting off all because he can't be the boss. Hey, I'm not fucking shuffle tea, you know. I'm slagging you off there. Just listen. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, but listen, pre this, Bob, it's left me amazed. Come on. How the fuck do you sound like you're from an expensive estate but then look like you haven't got a pence to your name? Yeah. <laughs> Don't you two be coming around here acting dead clever with grace? What, because you did some GCSEs? So, Because <laughs> <laughs> you did what? GCSEs? So, <laughs> be coming around here acting dead clever with grace? What, because you did some GCSEs? So, <laughs> GCSEs? What's that, chat? What do you think it is? GC. It's like w wellness retreats? <laughs> yeah, it's something to do with an author for sure. Yeah, uh, it's probably a soccer well player. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You think it's a wellness retreat? <laughs> it's like a wellness retreat. I think it's like a university or something like that or something. Mm. Some educational shit. Mm. It's like a, they get to eat exotic foods, like anything other than like chips. And yeah, anything other than beans. <laughs> yeah. like, here's a vegetable. They're like, what's this? It's green. It's green, mate. Yeah, it comes yeah, from the ground. Yeah. Where'd you get this GCSEs? Around <laughs> here, acting dead clever with grades. What? Because you did some GCSEs. <laughs> oh, it's like SATs. You two be coming round here acting dead clever with grades. What? Because you did some GCSEs. <laughs> so fucking what, mate? We did our MDMA. <laughs> <laughs> What, mate? We did our MDMA. Way cleverer than you, mate. So don't be attempting today to use your education to brag. Because I hate to break it to you, but me and him were getting class A's. Way before you was getting A's in a class. <laughs> Plus, all your high grades came on a piece of paper. And all our high grades came in a bag. Plus, we... Plus we was getting about in a hood way before someone gave you a pass, you little dude. What are you doing? Oh, 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 that's my line. That's my line. Sorry, sorry. 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 You're making me mad. Right, do you know what? Fuck you, but call it a day. It's a wrap. Time. That was yeah. my line. Yeah. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit, that ending was crazy chaotic. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking we're ending time. That's my line. <laughs> Fuck. I need some GCSEs after yeah, watching that. Holy shit. Um... I think this is it. It's one of it was great and it was fun. Um, my impression of the of scapegoat of of Bobby and Raptors round is that they lean too far into uh, Shufflo's strengths. Yeah, yeah, it's totally like it's good to do that a little bit. Yeah. Um, but you don't want to use your opponent's superpower and not be as good at it because they've mastered that. The you know, and so a lot of their rounds kind of were, like, or a lot of uh, scapegoats rounds seem flat to. It's like the same note of this conversation and like half argument and. Sh uh, Shufflo can pull it off because they put these peaks and valleys in it yeah. and build ups yeah. and things and they'll switch it and then like take a, a curve, you know, and throw mm -hmm. a curveball in it and mm -hmm. stuff um, that adds more variance yeah. where uh, I just, it just felt like skate goes were kind of imitating Shufflo and totally. but not as entertaining, you know? And it's like, it, it, that, even that says something. It's like, oh, we're trying to do what the thing everybody is watching this battle to see. Yeah, yeah. It's like the yeah. real thing that we're trying to get to that. But level. you started the whole thing like with the premise that they're not rappers, you know what yeah. I mean? Like, or yeah, like yeah. you said that in there. Yeah. But then yet you didn't rap. Yeah, yeah. In yeah. It. Like you did yeah. their conversation a bit, like a thing they did partially through it or whatever, but yeah. like for your whole round. And I felt know? like they were gonna get out of that and go into their like Kind of more grimy shit that they're yeah. no, both known for, and I was like, ah, it never happened. Yeah, I wanted to see them like, oh, do, do a conversation, yeah. and then go, fuck that, like this yeah, is exactly. us, like yeah, boom, yeah. boom, boom, and like do something that Shuffle and Marlo can't do. Yeah, exactly. You know what I mean? I was expecting that same thing each time, yeah. and then when it kind of just 
it kind of was repeated the same flow and mm-hmm. cadence and tone. It was a, you know, but it was fun and like it seemed like they were having fun. It wasn't like it was whack, you know. Yeah, totally. It was just like a hard act to follow. Yeah. Uh, coming off of Shufflow's first, first round. Yeah, for sure. But we'll probably see more rapping and shit second. Yeah, and third, I, I'm you know? assuming that was the first round. Like, let's get this out of the way and then get into the things we're known for. Yeah. All right, let's go. Mm. Hey, sorry, I'll go bad again. <laughs> Not as good as I thought it'd be. Mm. A bit disjointed. Mm. What did you make of it? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Not the instant review. Hmm. Plus, him like drinking totally seems like he's like authentically like criticizing. You're like, yeah, I'm not not the best. What, and what do you and think? that that's the thing. Like, you can write dialogue and write these things, but like, they're just they just got it. They yeah. get that thing, you know. Mm. And it's in the performance and 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 the writing too. You Dude, know, Frack and Shuffle have to battle, man. That would be so good. They have to. Yeah, it's like. I I think it should happen on premiere too. I think that would be the best oh, setting dude. for it. That'd be so sick. Yeah. And like they'd love Frack. Yeah. Again, totally. I said this on the last uh uh battle we watched with Tony D and O'Shea. O'Shea. Yeah. Uh but one of my favorite or maybe might be my favorite crowd experience, like with with you the soul? soul battle. Yeah. Yeah. That was so good. fun, man. Yeah. <laughs> Disappointed. <laughs> the thing is, though, to be absolutely fair, to make sure they're not biased here at all in any kind of way, and you know, you know the bases there in any kind of way, you can't spell scapegoats right. without putting. No, no, no! You laugh. And look at the words base in the first place. You try spelling scapegoats without that goats in it. <laughs> all you get. Is the word scale? <laughs> word play. <laughs> the best thing about either of you is shoy. That's my. <laughs> Something cut kicks off, you two run to his gaff and jump on a track. You made a fucking album of diss tracks to NLC. You weren't even the ones in the scrap under attack. One of the tracks was called Warning Shot, and the artwork was a target on somebody's back. <laughs> wow, original. <laughs> How'd you come up with that? <laughs> <laughs> Robin brings you to the bus. It was him! <laughs> yeah, 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 it was He's you. Like, God damn it. <laughs> Got announced. You saw the fans were there for us, not both of you. You could never touch our total views. So all that chat to no loose no. chat through your loose connections, just a promo shoot. A couple pitch invaders. That's the best you're coming closest to because you had to jump in and try to cross some lines to get everyone to notice you. Yeah, my mum called again and she still thinks you're a cunt. <laughs> So it finally happened, Ryan. A magistrate ruled you had to stop sniffing the yak. But, as you can see, he's not sticking to that. <laughs> Shit, earlier today he came up to me like, Shuffle, give these class A's a butchers. <laughs> I said it looks kind of weird. He said, nah, mate, that makes it good. <laughs> <laughs> this will send you up there with fucking Yahweh and Buddy. <laughs> Long story short, Raptor sold me a sachet of sugar. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you, literally just, you literally just bought a crushed up box full of Tic Tacs. Still, 50 quid's worth. Not to be sniffed at. <laughs> no. The court order would never believe anything he says. Cause that cocaine's got him more strung out than Gretchen from Reset. And that violent edge, oh. the violent edge, just a side effect of the drugs he'd mess with to de-stress. Call him Andy Dufresne. If he gets through enough rock to help him escape, he'll eventually see red. 
Doing, see, doing coke around the oh, clock was making you quite manic. Till that note from the cop was like breaking in light traffic. Cause it drove you to stop. But you're playing it like Alice. Cause you don't want to stop. Chasing the white rabbit. You've been sober for what? Like a day in your life? Can it, man? We know that you're not. It's blatant, the guy's stashing. Why didn't that blow in his top? Cocaine in those white pants. That's why he's blowing his top like inflating a life jacket. <laughs> He rocked up to his court hearing. He knew he must have lost the case. He was as sober as a judge. Okay. The judge was off his face. <laughs> <laughs> and Bobby, you did a whole round about Georgie Root's family member passing. Mm. He was listlessly demoralized, and as soon as that round was over, instantly apologized. <laughs> he said you didn't and he said you didn't have to say sorry, it's a battle. Cause it's simple, he's a solid guy. But the fact you did just means you knew initially it wasn't right. Mm. He apologized again and said, yeah, but still, it's not on, is it? <laughs> just look at this cunt, pathetic. Bobby, if you shouldn't have fucking said it, then you shouldn't have fucking said it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but still. <laughs> it's not on, is it? That it's not, not, it's not, not on, it's not on. It's not on. <laughs> You're boxing with him. Sorry about the punch to the face earlier. Uh, that wasn't cricket. What do you mean? That's what you do in a boxing match if you want to win it. <laughs> yeah, but still. <laughs> <laughs> it's not on, is it? <laughs> Doctor's visit. Sorry that I shoved my fingers up your asshole. Honey. <laughs> <laughs> not really. really. You were just examining my prostate with it. <laughs> yeah. It's not on, is it? <laughs> right, imagine a courtroom, right? Bobby's in it. He's the prosecuting lawyer. Honor killings, proper twisted. The perpetrator was not acquitted. Open and shut. Over and done. He knows from the jump he's got convicted. Not a pot to piss in. Other side of the courtroom. Oh. Bobby's got. <laughs> Bobby here is getting hugs from the victim. But something in his eyes isn't right. Like, it wasn't finished. What is missing is bothering him. Bobby's just doing his work using the skills that God has gifted. Six months pass by. Winter creeps in. <laughs> Interior, Bobby's kitchen, nondescript. He's bottle sipping. Can't stop the drinking. On his final drop of Guinness, washing dishes, stops a minute. Pops into the Honda Civic. Cut, interior jail cell, night, knock, knock, you've got a visit. What, who is it? You are not gonna believe this. <laughs> Bobby's sitting, sorry, grimace. Hot cup of coffee with him. The inmate takes a seat. What are you doing here? Stop. Just listen. <laughs> Look, I'm uh, sorry that I swayed the jury when I got that image of the victims and it shocked the witness. Look, I'm not a fan of being locked in prison. But <laughs> you're a lawyer. You're just doing your job, it's business. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> in your first two on two, calmly and comfortably, and retire from battles forever, you gotta laugh at the fucking cheek. If this is a send-off, it's two bodies parceled and dumped to sea. Bags left in the water to cause a stir. This is your hardly a cup of tea. They've made out like these two are the last of the ones to beat, but you're just two mates who rapidly come to spar with a sudden. There's no history, no winning streak. Where on this card would your number be if the two of us hadn't already left our mark on this fucking sea? We're the only two on two team you'll face. And after you're up and leave, we're in your city right now. But just ask you, they come to see our reason for existing. Our reason for existing is the mark of a double team. Your reason for existing is Marlow and Shuffle team. We're back on our bullshit. This is just a blood 
bar And the crowd throwing kissy faces, hugs and love hearts Spending two <laughs> minutes fitting a scheme that's fucking subpar To make a point that easily could have been done, done in one bar <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Yeah, Jesus Christ! That was fire. That that round, it it it, it started a little slow. I felt yeah, like, yeah. but it totally. but it, it definitely when Picked it up. got to the uh, courtroom and yeah. the whole acting out in yeah. the script, insane. Yeah, yeah. And again, their performance and all the intangibles. Like I don't want to sound like a broken record. Totally, it's so just fire, man. too good. That their their placement and how they move everything is just yeah. full commit. They're they're in their own their own league with that. You can go first now. <laughs> Don't be doing this, Bob. Fuck you, Raptor. I told you I'd be pissed off. <laughs> if what? If you told me that my idea was shit. But mate, it was. <laughs> was it no, was it? Uh, do you know what? Go on. Fucking try it then. Alright, I will. Marlo, you fucking big tough. <laughs> yeah. 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 Shit hot! <laughs> I fucking think not! Bro, that is never, ever, ever going to work. What, against two of the most toughest opponents on earth? Of course it will. It won't be you learn. Do you know how many times these two have wrote and rehearsed? They're gonna go in sync. The whole fucking crowd's gonna start going berserk. And what do you want? Doing no nuts? Talk about his fucking coat and his shirt. Of course I do. Of course I do. Bro, you're a bear. Mate, mate, that'll totally work. <laughs> nah, you gotta mix it up. Bit like that. Listen, punchlines. Have you done them before? Of course I have. Good, because you're gonna need them. <laughs> Have you done it before? Of course I have. Good, because we're going to need a couple of more. <laughs> now, for example, I'll go first and begin with this. Yeah. Let me show you the ropes, Bobby, before we meet these they, uh, Before we meet these two, swing from it. For example, your podcast is appalling. What a fucking pair of Disney kids. To beat us, you will need more in the locker than England in 66. Bad, bro. Oh, yeah. You ready? Yeah. Of course I have. Right. Well, fucking give him it. You give him it. Fuck Listen, that, that isn't art. Stand back and watch this. <laughs> I've already practiced me bars. <laughs> so you two seem to think that you're a big threat. But I don't see a massive guitar. <laughs> <laughs> All I can see is two big tits. Is this Pamela Anderson's bra? <laughs> These lot seem to have written us off. But I'm not crashing me car! <laughs> One second, kill me! He's not a doofus! He's not seen to have written us off, but I'm not crashing me car! It's actually part but Are you fucking with this? Yes, yeah, well, it's avant garde. You know, this is. I've always oh, wanted the A24, the, like the blur. Yeah, yeah exactly. Like the, yeah, totally. It's even like how the logo is. Or, or no, I'm thinking of Focus. Yeah, films Focus with features. The light. Yeah. Uh, okay, okay, gotcha. No, A24 is big. Uh, and I've told you this before. It's like every one of their horror movies is like naked old people. It's like they put that in all their like scary tropes. Like their horror tropes is like just throw a naked old person there. It's creepy. Like barbarian, like hereditary. Uh, is barbarian a twenty four? Say hereditary. <laughs> hereditary. <laughs> is, is barbarian a twenty four? I don't know. I, I, it might be focus actually, but I don't know. Yeah, but that's like a big trope that they use. It's like kind of becoming like a cliche. I need to watch some of these a twenty four horror films. Yeah. <laughs> you, know? you haven't seen hereditary? I've seen hereditary. Sure. Yeah. It's like the girl, she, like, a little weird looking girl. I don't want to, like, say anything because it will, like, give I've away the story. I've seen Hereditary for sure. Okay, word, word, Yeah, word. and the mom? Yeah, the mom, exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. For sure, it's been a while, though. Yeah. I'm not crashing me car! But what probably happened here, and the reason why I'm not, like, tearing into it, is I bet what happened is the other camera's batteries died, and they had to use that angle. It's mm -hmm. happened to me before, honestly. So, and what do you think the the person who was operating this angle was doing? 
just fucking just watching the battle. <laughs> They're just like, so shit. Yeah. Like, damn. Yeah. Ma! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this thing's on? Yeah. <laughs> One second, Cooney! He's not, no, no, he's not seen to have written us off, but I'm not crashing my car. It's actually Pat back at the yard! Yes, yeah, not to like that! Kind that's of just how you let's, let's go back to the sound. Do yeah, that's like that's me looking at the chat. <laughs> that's yeah, you and you, know, and, you know, and you know when it kind of went into focus, you're like, yeah. oh, he's got the focus now. That's how me like squinting, it's yeah, like yeah, a little yeah. bit more, but not quite there. <laughs> it's like sure. when I'm trying to see the score of the fucking game at the gym. I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck. can you see the score? I'm like, I can see there is a score. Yeah, there's no <laughs> something there. Yeah. Yeah. Again, mate, I cannot be asked. <laughs> Listen to the point I'm trying to make. Let me get the pad for the chart. No, mate, you can shove your pad up your ass like you sat on a star. <laughs> Don't fucking encourage him, yeah? All right, you know what? As soon as you think you're so fucking funny, yeah? I'm going to do some jokes. Yes, yeah, stop, stop. Oh, Bob. <laughs> What's up now? Why did the chicken cross the road? I don't know, Bob. To get to the little poncy posh cunt's house. Hey. I, don't, I don't get it. I don't get it. I knew he should have been on their team. Marlo, knock, knock. Pizza. The chicken. That's too much fun. Why did the chicken go off the road to get to some yeah, little knock, pond? Knock. Yeah. <laughs> the chicken's there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's funny. Yeah, that's actually really funny. Yeah. Scribble Jam <laughs> jump. Huh? Scribble Jam synchronized jump. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> No, Bob. To get to the little poncy posh cunt's house. <laughs> I, don't, I don't get it. I don't get it. I knew he should have been on their team. Marlo, knock knock. Pizza. The chicken. That's really funny. We're gonna try angles. Ooh, I used to play those. <laughs> you meant the shapes. Oh, why didn't you just say oh, so? No, I meant angles like the bars he feeds from Carter Deans and the angle which he used in him v soul, you know, ripping off a fella like Shakespeare, but you know that's a Cynthia. Ooh, oh, wow. Oh, he made a film. Well, it's one we're never going to watch, but listen, he invited all his, he invited all his friends to a special area at the premiere and everyone forgot. Really? What's the name of the film? Everyone forgot! <laughs> oh, no, well, did they remember it or what? Whoa, 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 you ought to be careful what you're saying when Adam's in the place. Why? Don't be slagging off his mate. Oh, did you not see him in the second round? <laughs> <laughs> Don't be slagging off his mate. Wait, did you not see him in the second round first, can I, when he was snapping in an angry little rage? Oh, he only did actually, it's great! Well, mate, you wouldn't be saying that if he was marching up to spark you in the face. I think we should be on guard from him in case. Well, it is now. Oh, shit, he's gonna stop us! Oh, no, it appears he's only started the debate. <laughs> <laughs> well, listen, you so didn't mind it, no. Bobby Rex. <laughs> That's uh, but... A Ward and Shoddy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not so hey! It's not far from the estate. And it's pretty fucking dangerous round here when it's dark and getting late. And we know it's pretty far to the apartment where you stay, and I'm not being funny, but you two are definitely gonna be targeted as prey. Yeah. <laughs> Piccadilly Gardens isn't safe. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> to the department where you stay and I'm not being funny boy you so we're definitely going to be targeting this prey Piccadilly Gardens isn't safe oh yeah little, little, oh yeah little Martin and his mates and when they see you and Marlo with your case they're going to start giving chase and judging by your look and size oh. you can't have any pace no so what we're going to do lads is offer you the bargain of the day and we're going to charge minimum rate and we're even going to include a very own personal tour of any bar or any rave and in the morning we're even going to escort you in a car right to your train and we're not going to ask for money or your card for you to pay. All we're going to ask is that you let us win this battle and get your asses off the stage. (laughs) 
the ending was really good and then that joke part was funny yeah, yeah. but it's like the same thing and, yeah. but even worse where yeah, I'm like yeah, rap right. yeah yeah you said you rap yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like shoddy like shuffle was more sad had more moments of serious like they sprinkled in a couple like I, I, I was trying to like oh don't forget that line that Marlo delivered where he was like it was a serious bar yeah um but yeah like they had more moments of like attack yeah and not being direct and like the kind of like half arguing and oh bit is like out like yeah. i don't want to see that at all in the yeah day. yeah you know? like, i want old. y'all to rap like, yeah yeah that, it, it's it's out yeah <laughs> you know what i mean totally. like it's kind of it's like hurting a yeah. Bit. yeah yeah <laughs> you yeah. know what i mean but yeah don't lean into your opponent's strengths or try it too much you know yeah i do what you do yeah and like i think you've said it before is like try to make their strengths their weakness somehow if you can you yeah know, you're making their strengths the look more yeah, strong exactly. you know like you're like i'm gonna try what you're doing yeah it's like you're not known for that though yeah it's know? like conveys the message like oh not everyone can do this yeah you yeah. know, it like makes yeah. them look better. You yeah, know, it's like at the end of you know. Connor and Nate Diaz, where Connor tried to fucking wrestle Nate Diaz, and Nate's like, "Oh, you're a wrestler now." It's like that same fucking thing. Mm -hmm. Like, do what you're good at. You yeah, know, you'll succeed. Yeah, and you could sprinkle it in and like to kind of match speeds. It's like this delicate balance. Yeah, where you do want to show you can do a little bit of what your opponent does, just to like kind of blend the styles and this like. I don't know, performance, so to speak, or whatever. Mm -hmm. And it can also kind of ground you in that moment. Um, but it's a fine line where it becomes, it starts to hurt you. Yeah. You know? yeah and I've, how... I've done the same thing. Like, I've there's been a few battles where I'm like, Ugh, I like I was too influenced by my opponent yeah. here. Yeah, you know, is that because you're digesting it as you're preparing? You're like, oh, like you're watching so much of their material that like I think it that's naturally influences it. I think that's a lot. It's like anticipation of what the crowd anticipates. It's anticipation of what the vibe is going to be and wanting to match it, mm. um, and to like not fall victim to their strength. So it's like, oh, I got to do it to neutralize it too. Mm -hmm. um, but it is, it's a delicate dance. It's a delicate balance to strike between doing that a little, but not losing yourself in it. Yeah. And it, fe it feels like at this point like that, like scapegoats has lost their self yeah. in, in the battle, you know? Yeah, that's very true. Yeah. All right, let's get into the third round. Really, like, this whole approach is like defied all expectations. Like, <laughs> fucking. <laughs> You clever cunts. <laughs> Can we agree? What you're seeing here is more pantomime than anything we've ever done. <laughs> Please be king prepared. It's always I do, buddy. Always. Kick his ass, you guys. I feel oh. what you're saying about how, uh, you know, the Piccadilly Gardens isn't safe. Yeah. But in order to protect my eye, I need someone to guard me from his veins. <laughs> <laughs> you can't. It's a good flip. It's a good flip. It's a good flip. It's a good flip. All right, all right. I know if he shot You can't spell <laughs> <Go on. laughs> without. Putting the ghosts in it. <laughs> S C. Okay. I mean, they're not wrong. No, 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 no. Bloody wonder words. They must have learned from a fucking stern teacher. Can you spell it without the scape in it? I'll just check. No, that doesn't work either. <laughs> so, is this phenomenon exclusive to the word scapegoats, or is it? Is that just English? <laughs> For example, can you spell the word cupboard without putting the cup in it? <laughs> it's called, it's called closed right. compound. Right. Otherwise, the word's not there. It's unfinished. <laughs> like, for example, airbrush. Yeah. That's a closed compound with air and brush. Is it? <laughs> Do you want to hear an actual fucking angle, Manchester? Yeah! Because <laughs> Ryan here, fucking carrying something on his back. Possible. 
<laughs> like the mother of all backbreakers, and now he's got a date with Destiny, and we're the fucking matchmakers. He has been fucking begging to get on Sounds Like, my new panel show. <laughs> We said, no, you're not that famous. So in response, he sent us a picture of his cat's anus. <laughs> Seems like the right response. <laughs> right now, right now you're looking at each other like, man. Shuffle T and Marlo used to be so good. <laughs> what kind of shit are they smoking? I promise you, this is one of their ones where I wish we were joking. <laughs> you alarmed to the Get me on the show. You sent a full blown photograph of your cat's asshole. You're a negotiation legend. <laughs> They turn you down for the 15th time, thought you were getting there, but no luck. So it's Felix, come here. Are you ready for your close up? <laughs> we don't know that for sure. To be fair, the cat could have been sending us his own butt. <laughs> Adam, think! It's a cat! It's How's no it going to be texting you with no thumbs? <laughs> Swerve back to a bird. Yo, have you ever heard about Hemingway's fucking estate? They have cats with thumbs. You heard about this? No. Yeah, isn't that crazy? What? Yeah, I know. It's like really weird. I uh, was listening to some podcast where they're talking about Hemingway's estate that he has. I, I don't know if it's like a museum or something dedicated to him, but uh -huh. they like bred cats that have thumbs there. It's fucking weird as hell. Cats don't have thumbs? Well, you know, not technically. Don't they have that little, like, no. higher one? I don't think you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, or is that on dogs, dogs or it's what? It's on dogs right here. Dog yeah, it's like a videos. higher thing. Yeah. But that's, there's no nail in that thing. It's weird. It's just like a bump. It's strange. For, for, for dogs. No, she has a nail on it. Oh, she does? Yeah, yeah. So dogs have thumbs. Yeah, yeah, thumb. It, the high but it's thumb. not a joint. Yeah, it's not j a okay, joint. It doesn't have a... We'll get to the bottom. Hemingway of this. Thumb, cat thumbs. And he Hemingway's a, a British soccer player, right? Yeah, he's famous for that. Or a football player. Look. What? Okay, yeah, that's not how a cat. Poly polydactyl looks. cat. That's crazy looking. Yeah, <laughs> it could be weird. that. It looks like it's like like a bald fist. Like it won't yeah, look, I know, look, I it's like it's gonna Arthur. punch you. It's like yeah, it's Arthur, yeah, Arthur me. For it's sure. Garfield's version. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. It looks threatening, or like it's that one's he's giving daps. Like good shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. The things you I learn you watching mean, terrible yeah. podcasts. But yeah, I don't know why it popped in my mind. No thumbs. No thumbs. <laughs> To a bird's flat, makes his way into the woman's room. She's lying down on the bed, legs akimbo, fully nude. He's like, lovely view, but where's your cat, you little Russian blue? She's like, Russian <laughs> <laughs> blues, your cats. Swerves back cats? to a bird's it's a flat. Breed. Russian blue. It's Russian. like the gray cats that you see. Uh, that are kind of the bigger ones? Uh, they're like normal size. Mm -hmm. You can definitely know. It's like the typical gray cat with like uh, really pretty eyes, usually green or blue They're like kind of long hair. It's like longer hair. Longer hair, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I know what you're talking about. He makes his way into the woman's room. He's lying there on the bed, legs akimbo, fully nude. He's like, what? lovely view, but where's your cat? A little Russian blue. She's like, that's not what I meant when I said I'll show you what that pussy do. <laughs> <laughs> Feline porn. Your new addiction. <laughs> He's a crazy man, dude. Stare at your son. He's there if you say. <laughs> Feline porn. Your new addiction. He can't hope to stop it. Thinks no one watches. But now this crackhead fucking with cats is an open topic like Joe Exotic. Oh. And Bobby. That's crazy. Bobby. Your entire social media persona is like one huge public stunt. All my birds. How 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 uh 
how much of a fight do you think Marlo had convincing Shuffle to not that we, like we can't just put Nostradamus in in because it rhymes with Joe Exotic. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, oh, there's a way. Yeah, <laughs> like, it's on the it list. Is. It's on the list. <laughs> it's in the book. <laughs> yeah, it's in yeah. the Bible. Yeah, chapter 56. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> For sure. Social media persona is like one huge public stunt. All my birds much prettier than yours. I play drums now. You utter <laughs> drums. <laughs> to making you someone fun. For Robert, there is such a thing as having too much of one. <laughs> oh yeah, I'll fucking have a few drinks, grab a few tits, slap a few chicks. Whoa, 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 put down your arrows, Cupid. <laughs> <laughs> I don't give a fuck if you think you have a huge dick. I don't give a fuck how many battles you win. Your fucking attitude stinks. You don't have to do this. Why do you chat such absolute <laughs> shit? <laughs> You took off your fucking hat and brushed your skin it. <laughs> That's not funny. That's not funny. That is not great or clever. If you're not a racist, you're the most racist, non-racist ever. <laughs> now guys, indulge us for a moment, yeah? <laughs> Start resting your eyes and simmer. Imagine you. This is the the CDCE, the, the wellness part of their education yeah, yeah, coming yeah, back yeah, in yeah, right here. Sure. <laughs> Start resting your eyes and simmer. Imagine you. Mindfulness. Yeah. And mindful. Yeah. <laughs> to a babbling brook. Mm. Set beside a river. Sit by a tree. <laughs> Feel the heavenly pine would shimmer. This battle's getting quite intense and you're both sweating, you're like gorillas. <laughs> and it's important to remember, boys. Stress is a silent killer. Mm. Honestly, I'm concerned. Oh, here we go. Which is why I've written this case report. And it seems the two of you are happiest when physically breaking jaws. <laughs> If I may take the floor. <laughs> when do you feel at peace? Hmm. Is it when playing sports? Is it perhaps when your children bring you a lovely picture that they have drawn? A dinner you've made for four? Chicken satay and corn. Earlier, <laughs> we had you right down. Okay, so they're doing this like back and forth and conversational thing, but this exact portion right here is another example of like a valley. Like they're even using yeah. their voice and yeah, tone yeah. to like differentiate from their other material that could come off exactly like earlier material mm -hmm. you know what i mean but they yeah. it's like they calm down even the the f into yeah, yeah, it yeah. and it's like their voices are kind of creating this lull between because mm -hmm. they could they could have kept it where they the were before yeah. delivering all this <laughs> like, <laughs> chicken satay and corn i'm <laughs> into the baby you know what i mean <laughs> <laughs> you know what i'm saying though like and then it becomes like white no <laughs> <laughs> Two chickens and tan corn. I'm pretty sure he they did that say that. Me. I was going to make fun of that. He's a <laughs> fucking gross dog. Yeah. What the fuck? Yeah. Wait, it, it, it's chicken satay. Oh, and satay? so like corn on the cob yeah. and then a chicken satay. Yeah. What? What's wrong with that? So, I don't know. I just don't fuck with like anything that's not like, uh, like even broiled chicken is like gross to me. It's like nasty. Broiled? Gotta get it, gotta get it grilled. Even baked chicken, I kind of don't even fuck with. I'm like, it's all on how it's like seasoned and all that shit. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. Just put a bunch of chicken salt satay from a it. Thai place, though. Oh yeah, yeah. You yeah. Know Maybe what I'm, I'm just saying? like ignorant to what sautéing really is. I just never well, I think a chicken, chicken. satay is like on a skewer. What? Yeah, chicken satay. Oh. At least at the Thai spot, yeah. There's like an appetizer where it's basically just on a little stick, like on a. I skewer. literally saw sautéed mean like marinade. There is a saute so when you saute something, and it I think it's like cooking, like on a, in a pan. Oh, or of course, it's some fucking skewer shit. Yeah, I think okay. it is the on a it makes chicken on a skewer. Yeah, yeah okay. and then corn also. Yeah, I don't think the think corn's the corn on the skewer. <laughs> you know, just little yeah. kernels of corn in between the pieces of chicken. <laughs> <laughs> it's corn on the car. So it's yeah. two things on a thing. Yeah, two things. Two on foods on, on a thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> 
corn on the cob is just corn satay. Yeah, you know, pretty much. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I, th- that was one thing I noticed. Like, they c- totally could have delivered this. Like the other At stuff, the same they're, level. Ri- they're graded. Like, okay, we're gonna <laughs> refresh. You know. Yeah. Yeah. When do you feel at peace? <laughs> Is it when playing sport? Is it perhaps when your children bring you a lovely picture that they have drawn? A dinner you've made for four? Chicken satay and corn! <laughs> Earlier, we had you write down three things that you're grateful for. <laughs> Raptor, you've put puss in boots, <laughs> Nicolas Cage and war. <laughs> the year of the scapegoats, is it? Then you're gonna be in the next shovel tea in Marla. Do you know what we've done for this biz? We've made we've made fans appear out of nowhere like a conjuring trick. Fans that became your fans too after a couple of hits of shuffle o Like you son of a bitch, fuck it, I'm in. People who weren't fucking <laughs> fuck- <laughs> <laughs> People who couldn't cut it with battles till they let the cut of our jibs. And we know that a lot of you think that we're the trouble with this. But without us constructing the bridge by being lovable pricks, the numbers for this wouldn't fucking exist. <laughs> so when I hear them, bra- so when I hear them bragging about views, you know what I tell them? I look them in the eyes and say, "You are fucking welcome." Because <laughs> yeah. you couldn't do any of the promotional shit we've brokered through this. You'd fucking tarnish the deal. It's simple, boys. The biggest difference between us? Market appeal! What happens? <laughs> what happens when Briggsy's on the cusp of a major deal with Vice and they dig up some old picture of Bobby on Facebook with a knife? Calling some ex- <laughs> <laughs> Calling some ex of his a cunt! Acting crazy for the lights! How are you the faces of a lead? You yeah, are- Eddie R is right. This isn't live. This is a pre-recorded video. Yeah. Eddie R in the chat right now. Yeah, He's right. This is pre-recorded. The faces of a f- acting crazy for the lights. How are you? The faces of a lead. You are the faces of a fight. What happens when a business exec is on the? He's uh, well, 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 get a major. Di- what happens when the business exec is? Uh, oh, what is it? What happens when a business exec? Uh, finds out about Raptor's altercations in his time and he sends an email to the Prem account like he's being taken for a ride and they, he's spoken to his lawyer and based on the advice they have to take their business elsewhere because that behaviour isn't right. Briggsy and Shy know all this and if you take the win tonight and make Scapex crystallise at some point they're going to have that conversation with you guys and explain what this is like. You're not professional enough to have your names emblazoned up in lights and if they try to tell you different it is blatantly a lie. You can't sell the dream of Del Dazim, the name just isn't right. The gap between us and marketability is fucking glacial inside. We are simply good for business. That's why our payment is so high. Because we're approachable, motherfucking stable and polite. We have <laughs> We have bridged the gap between this and that in ways you couldn't try. We've made UK battle rap more relatable and thrive. If Shotty gave the keys to scapegoats, they would break this from inside. And then you'd live up to that name when you're blamed because it dies. Mm, We've had sketches, promos, sponsorships, people paying us to ride. When a league works with Shuffle, it's plain, it's gonna fly. And the sad truth is. Because of all the past mistakes and the way you've lived your lives, you two are never going to be able to take it to those highs. And that's why you'll never be brand ambassadors. (laughs) (laughs) Because you both look like Ross Kemp. (laughs) And I don't know if Stella Artois or EDL are doing promotional content. (laughs) Trying to be like either of you in any way. I could never do that. Quick question, Theo. Yeah. Did you get a new hat? Yeah, this is from the market. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> That's good. And remember, man. And remember, Manchester. You can't spell shuffle tea and Marlowe without having that shuffle tea and Marlowe in it. <laughs> <laughs> So, like, right before that, like, last whole part, like, they were, it was a real angle, you know what I mean? Like, they were, like, talking to them, Mm -hmm. you know, like, say what you want about the angle, and, like, oh, there's a little bit of levity, like, in it. Yeah. But, like, they're saying, like, we're better brand-wise for a brand. Like, that shit y'all do is, like, you know, detrimental to the brand. And And they were rapping it. 
You yeah. know what I mean? So yeah. I, I need to see some rapping in yeah, let's go. Raptor, Raptor let's go and Rex's third. Come on. Cut them right back. Knife bars. We've got fucking props too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I like it. Is actually weed. Now, some viewers may find the following scenes harrowing and distressing. Viewers' discretion is advised. <laughs> All right, Rex, it's mission time. <laughs> Operation Travel Six is live. Now, this will be by far the toughest expedition that you have ever been assigned. But my God, if anyone can do it, then it's you, Rex. <laughs> Dude, how is he more, uh, like, he's easier to understand doing this weird voice than his yeah. regular voice. Yeah, his, uh, <laughs> Prohibition era <Yeah>. raptor <laughs> is, uh, <laughs> is easier to, re to understand for oh, sure. <laughs> Ah, gumshoe. Yeah. <laughs> so good. Viewer's man. discretion is advised. <laughs> All right, Rex, it's mission time. It's mission time. Operation Treble Six is live. Now, this will be by far the toughest expedition that you have ever been assigned. But my God, if anyone... He sounds like, for a second, he sounds like Be Real. <laughs> Did he sound like Beasley for a second? <laughs> <laughs> Did he? Listen, yeah. listen to this. To be by far the toughest expedition that you have ever been assigned. But <laughs> Does that sound like music? That freeze oh, frame yeah. too? <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> Holy fuck. All right, 3 0. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 3 0. <laughs> Scape goat, you can't smell. Yeah, the goats. <laughs> My no god, if anyone can do it, then it's you, Rex. Because <laughs> <laughs> you're the best there is alive. <laughs> and I don't know you do it, you sons of bitch. <laughs> but you managed to pull it off every single time. <laughs> Now listen, Rex. This should be that should be his new yeah. full time <laughs> yeah, thing. voice. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like when he talks, you're like, "Whoa, you're British." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's raps in an English accent. Yeah. Wow, you're modern. Yeah, you're from modern. Times? Yeah, you're from the millennials. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Got you as many men as we every single time. <laughs> now listen, Rex. We got you as many men as we could find. The weapons are supplied. The best there is to buy. We got you every specialist inside of every regiment assigned. We got you boats in the ocean and we got you planes ready in the sky. And these will all be with you and I on 20 minutes time. Now, <laughs> now the targets. Two of the most wanted men who is alive. And if you're checking your device for the messages that I've sent you with all of the intelligence inside, I sent it back on the 7th of July at 11.59. <laughs> now listen, Rex. The enemies are primed. And we are on their territory and we are entering it blind. And we don't know if they're solo or together for the fight. And these motherfuckers... <laughs> It's like a 007 briefing. Yeah, totally. <laughs> you know, yeah. it's like yeah. it's the, uh, Rex, yeah. Raptor's voice coming out of a watch. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. And I said, these motherfuckers <laughs> are the most deadliest combined, and they are prone to attack us, Rex, at any given time. <laughs> We're all counting on you back here, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot. What is this accent? It's like fluctuating between so many different things. It sounded like almost country. Oh, come on, you back here, buddy. <laughs> yeah, that's like, you sounded like Louis, like yeah, Louisiana. Louisiana. Yeah. Like, <laughs> right there. Be given time. We're all counting on you back here, buddy. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Me and the rest of us inside. Look, everyone say hi. Hi. Hi, Raptor. Well, best of wishes, guys. Sir, sir, before you leave, are you aware that everything just rhymes? Okay, this is it. 
We just got to go ahead the mission's live. We've got 20 minutes, guys. Make sure everything is primed and ready. I want your weapons at your sides. I want extra clips and knives. I want medikit supplies. You want to get to kiss your wives again, then we remember it precisely as the <laughs> lieutenant just described. The intelligence provided is suggesting that they might be expecting this tonight and their defense is pretty tight. And yes, I am well aware that their pathetic little size makes it look like they have never been in fights. But please, when you get them in your sights, do not let them trick your eyes. Many good men have been and tried to kill them and they regularly die. <laughs> this is their territory and they've had it specially designed to help them whenever there's a crisis. And up until today, all access has been denied. That's like... There you go. All access has been denied. So we're going to unexpectedly surprise them and we're getting in behind. I'm going to get him on the left. Raptor, you get him on the right. Wait, wait, wait. Not yet. When I give the sign. <laughs> And only at that set specific time. Well, sir, there's no time like the present. So let me present you him and I. Dr. Jekyll. This is high. With the devil's in disguise. Since him possessing us inside. Just twisting like the exorcist. It's about to be very sick I tonight. I will walk in any forest. Mm -hmm. And you'd be stupid if you think that Bobby Rex is knocking on letterboxes. I'll just walk in unannounced and test the porridge. Is that <laughs> You best believe that I'm sleeping in any of the fucking beds I wanted. Shit, I'll even put down a month's rent deposit and let the cottage and then Raptor roll back out like Eddie Brock in Venom's body. Mm. Now these two are gonna Right. You said like Petty Brock? Yeah. Like Petty like Brock in Venom. <laughs> yeah, that's sick. <laughs> Let the cottage and then Raptor roll back out like Eddie Brock in Venom's body. Mm. Now these two are gonna But then Raptor will black out like Eddie Brock in Venom's body. Now these two are gonna need wishing well. Get it? Is the penny dropping? Check his pocket. It's nothing but an empty wallet. He never got it, so we better get Inspector Frost detectives on it. Let's be honest, this is Decepticons. To Megan Foxes. This is Special Clones. To Bex and Poshes. This is Reds and Runners. To Bex and Poshes. And fuck the line up there, it doesn't matter though, because this it is. It doesn't matter, cause I'll chop your noggins off and let it hit the deck and cross it. That's heads and volleys. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. See, we needed more of that. More of this, you know what I mean? You made for this! <laughs> He's so lucky now! Call him in, bro. Call me out of this shit. Ouch! Hey! I'll chop his noggin off and let it hit the deck and cross it. That's heads and bullets. And if I get any one single objection from it, tell him I couldn't care less. The boss is me like Brendan Rogers. Fuck his fuck. Fuck his fuck. I couldn't give a fuck if it's selling copies. If you think that's something I've read, then stop it. Like a zebra crossing. Cause these two took a shot like espresso coffees. But they cheddar bobbed it, took their own leg and shot it. But they were small print and these two should have been checking for Instead, it. Instead, they went diving in head first and ended up belly flopping. Shit, we were in international battles. These two were the second option. You're just two stones and we're stepping on them. Fuck it, beating you all out from the flight like Tesla profits to SpaceX's rocket. You couldn't. Yeah. Hey, I said fuck it, beating you all out from the flight like Tesla profits to SpaceX's rocket. You couldn't see us two with Professor Cox's telescopics when he's inspecting comets. Now like the Pentagon. Oh. He's about to get his defense demolished and be right in the World Trade Center of it when the second one hits. The skin mm. comes in a rag with a jaw dropping bang. You yeah. thought we was playing with fire, it's just a torch swapping hands. We ain't fucking finished. Uh, well, Yo. you seem like you finished. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Liam 3 -0. holy shit, holy fuck, dog. He's like, trust me, you want to stop there. Yeah, yeah, you stop were, you right were ahead. <laughs> well, you seemed like you were finished. Oh my god, dog, that was fucking brutal. Because I saw Raptor be like, we're not done. Yeah, yeah, Liam's yeah. doing the. <laughs> Fire is just a torch swapping hands. Well, you seem like you finished. Oh, yeah. Go, Gun! Should we both find? Both No, 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 you should have listened to Liam. You should have listened to Liam. He's a professional. Yeah, he knows. He knows. He knows. Oh my god, that was so funny. Liam, for sure. Yo, damn. Yeah, a little too much, too late. I feel from Raptor and Bobby. Like that shit would have hit so much harder if they just did it the whole time, and probably would have made the the battle like yeah, too. Yeah, like. 
wep- the rapping was great that round. Yeah. And it seemed like they were attacking. And if they just did that in the other rounds, even it's like even if you're still doing that other stuff, but just less and you're placing those chunks in yeah. to show there's a difference between us. We could do this that you do, but look, and then yeah, do that yeah, rapid yeah, totally. fire back and forth. Yeah. It creates a contrast. You yeah. know what I mean? That that not e- like Marlo and Shuffle can't do what Raptor yeah. and Rex do. Totally. Like they do it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. So it's like set that difference. Uh, I will say the first like third of their round on that like long ass rhyme scheme. <laughs> okay, the, the prohibition yeah, the like prohibition, yeah, Mission Impossible was was, was hilarious. Strange. But like it never, um, it yeah, didn't. No it never amounted to yeah. anything. Like well, you were just like, it was like they were setting, rhymes. They were like, setting it up to do that later. They're like, okay, here's your mission, and then them doing the trade off at the end was like their mission. I'm like, you should have set the mission in like eight bars, yeah, exactly. and then gone into totally. rap. because it was just this prolonged way of like being like, all right, are you? Is everyone yeah, ready? Yeah. This thing's getting it's coming. Ready. This thing, yeah, we're about to be here, and it's like. I thought what it was gonna like land on is basically like that's what you do, shuffle. Like yeah, yeah. you just rhyme, there's no punches. Here's the difference. Punch, punch, yeah, punch, yeah, punch. Yeah, yeah. But like it never it just seemed like it was rhyming to rhyme without a, making the point of like that's what you do. Yeah, totally. But then once they started ra- like really rapping or whatever, like at the end back and forth. They should have did a lot more of that. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not mad at uh, edging them that third because mm-hmm. it was like it was the only time that that really was done in the whole battle. And it was hitting pretty hard. Yeah, and Shuffle's third was good, uh, but it wasn't their best round. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, and I'm, yeah. So I'm not mad at giving scapegoats that, and but calling it the first two were clear by Shuffle. Yeah, Shuffle, Shuffle Marlo, for Shuffle. sure. Uh, yeah. Shout out Chase Moore in the chat. What up, Chase? We're going to do another watch in the ne- coming days. Uh, yep. Fredo's in town. You know what I mean? We got to do another one. Yeah. Yeah, we got some watches on the way. Um, yeah. Uh, thanks for watching that watch with us. If you guys want to choose a battle to go on the wheel, you can go to patreon.com slash ruin your day now. Choose any battle as long as we haven't watched it. We'll watch it. Um, salute to, I forgot who chose that. I think his name was Marcus. If I'm incorrect, I want to get his name right. But salute to uh, Marcos Guerrero for choosing Raptor and Bobby Rex and Shuffle T. Marlowe. Salute to all four of those gentlemen. Yeah. Salute to it's Liam. Good vibe, good salute battle. to Briggsy, uh, Shoddy over there at Premiere. You know, we're big fans. Um, yeah, we're going to end on that. Uh, Riderdie.com for the new merch. Both these things are up there. There's an exclusive discount code if you order for the first time, so go over there for all the new merch. We're going to be doing a lot of merch now because we kind of reformatted how we do merch now, so there's going to be like new designs up there very often. So tune into that, and uh, you got anything to plug? Nah, man. Riderdie.com. Let's go. Well, go to the Patreon.com, Ilmac TV. You might see uh, a new uh, One Above session coming soon. So. Let's go. Hell yeah, guys. All right, thanks a lot. Peace out.